yesterday honey we kicking these videos out i'm so excited you guys i'm having a ball with you guys again i i i we're gonna talk we're gonna talk but first you guys i have been craving soul food for so long <laughs> got it you guys this soul food came from serena's soul food in wilmington delaware she is amazing the customer service is amazing you guys she hooked me up so sweet so kind i cannot wait to dig in you guys we have macaroni and cheese i haven't <laughs> i haven't tasted it yet i don't know what it tastes like but i'm so excited i have macaroni and cheese this is apple candy yams you guys and I put the candy yams next to the macaroni and cheese. Because, honey, if you eat candy yams and you eat macaroni and cheese and it's all Thanksgiving and Christmas, you know, you got to mix it together. And then we got whiting here, fried whiting. And she gave me bread. And we have collard greens, you guys. Collard greens are my favorite. I love collard greens. It's like my favorite thing with soul food. And we have seafood um, mac and cheese here. I got some hot sauce that I'm going to go ahead and crystal's hot sauce that's the best hot sauce for um soul food in my opinion and oh shoot and um and i have um some mustard here for my um for my fish because you know you i like i like mustard on my fish and to drink i have a ginger ale you guys, y'all don't know what's about to happen right now. <laughs> y'all don't know what's about to happen. I think I might, I might end up shouting, cutting a stack, honey, going back to church. I don't know what's going to happen. But I looked at the reviews and the reviews are really good. And then I went in there and I got it today. So I'm really, really excited. I'm hungry. Let me taste these calories real quick because, you know, sometimes you need to put a little something on it and it's nice and hot. Stop playing! Stop playing with me with these collard greens! It don't need nothing. Because, you know, sometimes we need, like, vinegar and hot sauce and stuff, and it don't need nothing on it. Y'all. Y'all don't understand how bad I wanted some seafood. I really don't think y'all understand it. I wanted some, I mean, some collard greens, some soul food. All right, let's get into this mac and cheese, you guys. Serena! Serena, stop playing. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Yes. Mmm. Let me taste these by itself. It's real sticky, too, y'all. Look at all that stickiness on there. Mmm. Y'all see that? Let me see. Oh, my God. Serena. Serena Soul Food in Wilmington, Delaware, y'all. Mmm. 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 This is seafood mac and cheese. Seafood salad. You know what? I'm a slapper. I'm a slapper. Yeah, I'm going to slap her. I'm going to knock her right out. Mm! Y'all, I'm telling you, I'm really, really picky when it comes to like potato salad, seafood salad, and stuff like that. Because everybody's stuff is just not hitting. This right here, honey, honey, stop playing with me. Stop playing with me right now. 
I think I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna do the bread because I'm not trying to get too full on y'all too early. But here's the whiting. Let me see how that's tasting. Mmm. Mmm. It's crispy, crunchy. And the mustard. It's good with mustard. I like my fish with hot sauce and mustard. Mmm. Let me put some more hot sauce on there. I had to get the packets of hot sauce from Serena's place because I don't have any hot sauce right now. Um, I need to go to the store, you guys. I need to get a lot of stuff from the store. Um, dang, but these packets are so hard to open. I'm not doing this no more. I ain't got time to be fiddling with no packet. Mmm. 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 It's seasoned so well. Everything. This is soul food right here. Mmm. This is soul food, honey. This is really good, y'all. Mm. I wanted this so bad. You just don't know. I wanted it so bad. I kept saying, I want some seafood. I want, I want some soul food. I want some soul food. Mm. But some of the soul food restaurants out here. Just it sometimes be dry and <clears throat> just not happy with it 100 percent and so mm, I am um, Serena honey shout out to you girl you did your thing mm. and it's a real cute little spot right in women's Ham. if you're familiar with women's Ham, it's right on the riverfront and like a little plaza area and you go inside and her um restaurant is in there and it's like other restaurants in there it's really cute really nice so sweet mm. honey any cosmos don't need nothing if you want to put hot sauce on it you can but i don't feel like i need anything mm. Oh. Everything is delicious. Seafood mac macaroni. Y'all, I don't eat everybody's seafood macaroni. I do not eat everybody's potato salad. Because, honey, you don't know what you get with that half the time. Mmm. I'm definitely gonna have to go to the gym after this <laughs> tomorrow morning. Mm. Honey, let me tell you something. You get some good soul food. You ready to fight? You hear me? You ready to fight whoever I'm cooked everything? Cause it's that good. Y'all know I don't do the soda, but I'm doing that today because I'm trying to still get 100% back healed. Uh, cause I was like sick. So, mm, 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 mm. do y'all make sure macaroni and cheese with the garlic, with the um, the yams? It's good like that. Mmm. The yams. These are apple yams. It's just perfect. Like everything is just perfect. Mmm. 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 -mm. Everything was hot, hot, fresh. And she did her thing. Uh. 
my lord. I can cut a step. I can cut a step. Yes, Lord. Mm. Can I get an amen? Can I get a witness, anybody? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes! I'm so happy. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. <laughs> I'm so serious, you guys. Y'all think I'm playing? No, I'm not playing. This is delicious. This is so good, y'all. So, 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 so good. Mmm. Mmm. I love me some collard greens. Mmm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Let me tell you something right here. This is good eating. This is good eating. Okay. Mm. Oh man. I did not want that to happen. Mm. Mm. Yes. My lord. Man, that is good. That is so good. Mm. 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 That's even good with that, like that. Mmm. Mmm. Y'all, let me tell you something. It is so hard to find some good soul food restaurants. It's a shame because you would think it's a lot of soul food restaurants. You would think but it's really not that many soul food restaurants. I mean, I know when I went to New Orleans, there was a few really good soul food restaurants. But um, when I was looking here in Delaware, when I was looking here in Delaware, it just really wasn't that many options. I think a few of them just started popping up here recently. But there was only like maybe like one or two and then I tried it and I was like really disappointed. And then like I know that there's one place in Jersey that I really like. I can't remember the name of it though. My grandmother, I know she's watching. Mother, can you please leave a comment down below what that restaurant in Jersey is, that soul food restaurant that you love? Can you put the comment down below so they can see it? It's, it's right in Jersey. It's really, really good. It's really, really good soul food. So if y'all are in Jersey, that's a place that y'all can definitely go to if you want some good um, soul food. But, um, Serena Soul Food, right here in Wilmington, Delaware. Absolutely, positively delicious. I'm very pleased, very satisfied. I'm most satisfied with um everything overall but i'm most satisfied with the seafood macaroni seafood salad just because i was actually a little bit nervous to try it because like i said i can go to a family function and i'm not even looking at the seafood mac i'm not looking at it i'm not touching it but for the sake of this video i was like let me go ahead and get it and try it um to my surprise It is really, really good. Really, really, really good. Seasoned so well. Mmm. Y'all. 
And the mac and cheese is good too, man. Mmm. Honey, I'm in heaven. You hear me? Absolute heaven. Mmm. I think the packs are hard to open because the juice from the collard greens. Next time, uh -uh, I'm not doing packets next time. That's just too much trouble. Nobody got time for all that. <clears throat> Honey, I'm trying to eat. And I, this is slowing me down. The whiting with the hot sauce and the mustard is bomb. Absolute bomb. Let's see if I can get this open with no problem. I hope so. Yes, okay. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. You hear me? Unbelievable. Mm. Mm. I'm not gonna eat this bread. Oh Lord. Bad. Oh, can I get an amen? Uh. Can I get an amen? Excuse me. church y'all with this we don't have to take it back to church mm. 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 make me want to sing a hymn Make me want to sing. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like. I found 
was blind but now I see to us grace that taught my heart to fear and grace my fears relieved how precious did that grace appear the I'm eating, I got food stuck in my throat. Y'all not about to be coming for me for how I was singing, honey. I did the best that I could, okay? With food stuck in my mouth and a, and a full tummy. Don't do it. Mmm. <laughs> so good. Mmm. My God, you guys. This is delicious. Delicious, 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 y'all. We can we we gonna have so much fun, man. I'm telling you guys, we gonna have so much fun, so much fun together, so much manifestation talk, so much positive talk, uplifting talk, encouragement, just all things good, all things positive. I love you guys so much, so so much, and I'm truly thankful. And I've said it before, I'll say it again. I'm so thankful for each and every one of you guys. I can be myself um, and laugh and play and joke. And, you know, you guys getting something out of the videos. And it just really makes me so happy. Um, you know, Amazing Grace is actually one of my favorite songs. My One of my favorite gospel songs. Um... It's such a beautiful song because we all need grace in our lives, you guys. You know, sometimes people like to point the finger. They like to judge you. They like to talk about you, talk down on you. You know, you ain't never going to amount to anything. You'll never be anything. You're a loser. You're this. People put so many labels on you. But how many people need grace? I know I do. And I know you do. We all need grace. Nobody's better than anybody. No mistakes are better than anybody's. Nobody's sin is greater than anybody's. Honey, because God don't look at, uh, you know, oh, this person is, is gay and then this person told a lie. There's no, there's no difference, baby. There's no difference. <laughs> there's no difference. So I want you guys, before you start judging somebody, before you start talking about somebody, before you point your finger at somebody, always remember that you got three more pointing back at you. When you got, when you point your finger at somebody, you got three more pointing back at you. So that means somebody knows the dirt that you have done. Somebody knows the lies that you have told. Somebody knows the bad things that you have done. And while you going around pointing your finger at somebody, you better make sure that you don't need grace yourself. You better make sure that your life is so perfect and that you ain't did nothing wrong to nobody. You ain't never done nothing. You ain't never told a lie. You ain't never stole nothing. You ain't never hurt nobody's feelings. You ain't never done nothing. You better make sure the next time you want to open up your mouth about somebody, you better hope and pray that God gives you grace. You better hope and pray that somebody gives you grace for the things that you have done, for the things that you have said, for the nastiness that you have been a part of. Come on, somebody. Don't make me start preaching up in here. We all need grace. We all need grace. We all need grace. We all need forgiveness. We all need somebody to forgive us. Come on, somebody. I know y'all don't. Come on. Don't sit up here and act like you all perfect. Please don't sit up here on this camera, on that TV that you're watching, on your phone that you're watching, 
on that laptop that you're watching, please do not sit up here and act like you ain't never needed no grace and act like you ain't never did nothing to nobody to hurt nobody's feelings and, and put somebody in a position in their life or whatever the case. You know what you've done. I know what I've done. I know what I've done. I know what I've said. Ain't nobody perfect. Ain't nobody perfect. But that's the thing about the internet. The internet is so perfect. I'm telling you, people on the internet, they're so perfect. They don't do no wrong. You understand what I'm saying? Like, they don't do no wrong. What if God said that he was going to cancel you for what you've done? What if God said that he was going to cancel you for the things that you have done, for the things that you have said, for, the, for, for being a fake friend? You understand what I'm saying? Talking about people. You, you, owe, you owe somebody money and never paid them back. You lied on somebody. You stretched the truth on somebody. Come on now. Come on. Come on. Come on, somebody. You was mean to somebody. You disrespected somebody. You hurt somebody's feelings. You broke somebody's heart. Come on now, ain't nobody perfect. Y'all can act like y'all perfect on this internet all y'all want to. Y'all can cancel whoever y'all want to cancel. But make sure God don't cancel your behind. Because honey, somebody can somebody sees it all. Somebody heard those conversations that you had plotting on somebody. Mm-hmm. Plotting revenge on somebody. God heard that conversation. God, God sees the DMs. God seen and heard it all. So before you point your finger at somebody, you better hope you don't need grace. You better hope that, that somebody can forgive you for all the wrong that you've done. Make sure of that, you guys. This ain't, this is just, I'm just talking. I'm just talking. I felt that in my spirit to say that. We all need grace. We all need grace. And I thank God for God's grace and mercy over my life. I'm not perfect. I never said I was perfect. I'm not perfect. I never said I was perfect. But I know I need God's grace all the time. I know I need God's love all the time. I know I need God's forgiveness all the time. And I know I'm not the same person that I was six months ago. I'm not the same person I was a year ago. I'm not the same person I was two years ago. And I thank God for that. I thank God for growth. I thank God for forgiveness. Because let me tell you something. Seventy times seven. You've forgiven me. <clears throat> you know what that means? Seventy times seven, you've forgiven me. That means that if I pray to God and ask God to forgive me, he places my sins into the sea of forgetfulness. Yeah, placing my sins into the sea of forgetfulness. That means that when you pray, and everybody has different religions, okay? I'm not coming, this is, this is, everybody got different religions. So if this don't relate to you, eat the meat, spit out the bones. But if you can relate to this, you pray to God and you ask God for forgiveness. And maybe you need to ask somebody else for forgiveness too. He, you've already been forgiven. You've already been forgiven. So move on, baby. Move on. Stop dwelling on what you've done. How you could have done something different. Living in the past. I don't know who needs to hear this right now. Who needs to hear this message right now? Somebody is constantly thinking about the past and constantly thinking about all that they have done. But God has already forgiven you for that. God has already forgiven you. You keep beating yourself up over and 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 over again. You can't change the past, baby. You can't change the past. You can only look forward to the future. You can only look forward to the future. The sin has been placed into the sea of forgetfulness, so that means that you need to move forward 
ask for forgiveness from whoever you need to ask forgiveness for if it's yourself forgive yourself if it's somebody else ask them for forgiveness ask god for forgiveness and move on if they keep wanting to talk about it that's on them because guess what 70 times 7 you forgiven me and placing my sins into the sea of forgetfulness yeah and placing my sins into the sea of forgetfulness oh, oh. placing my sins into the sea of forgetfulness yeah yeah placing my sins into the sea of forgetfulness i love you guys so much i love you guys so much there's so much that i would like to share with you guys i feel i feel so emotional right now oh my gosh i feel so emotional right now there's so much that i want to share with you guys there's so much that i want to say um but that's just on another video um i love you all i want you guys to be the best version of yourself possible forgive yourself honey i know what it's like i know what it's like to be carrying such a burden 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 i mean you 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 just can't forgive yourself you just can't like you just feel so bad you just feel so bad i've been there i've been there but you gotta let it go i don't know who needs to hear this message but you gotta let it go baby forgive yourself forgive them and move on the forgiveness is not for you when it comes to forgiving somebody else the forgiveness is not for them it is for you it's for you to move on it's for you to heal it's for you to cleanse yourself it's for you to move on i've had to forgive a lot of people i've had a, i had to forgive a lot of people i wanted to seek revenge on a lot of people a lot And I'm not even going to go there. I'm not even going to go there. But what I'm going to tell you is this. If God can forgive me for all the things that I've done. And not been the best person that I could have possibly been. If God can forgive me easily. No problem. No problem. No question. No question. No question. Not even a thought. Not even nothing. If God can forgive me. I should be able to forgive someone who's done me wrong. I can do that. Because I want forgiveness. Because I know I'm going to mess up. I know I'm going to do things. I know I'm going to say things. I know I'm going to do things. You understand? Whether it be, um, whether it be uh, purposely or unpurposely. Known or unknown. I know that I'm going to do something to hurt somebody sometime in my life. And I'm going to want grace. I'm going to want forgiveness. So I, so that's the message for today. Next time you think about judging somebody. Next time you think about canceling somebody. Next time you think about any of that. You ask yourself. If somebody knew the things that I've done. If somebody knew the things that I've said. Would I want to be canceled? Would I want to be treated like that? Would I want to be dragged? Would I want to be whatever? What I want to be, whatever the situation is that you're, that you're taking part in, in somebody else's demise. But guess what, honey? When God has his hand on your life, they can say whatever they want to say. They can do whatever they want to do. Because I know God's hand is on my life. I know God's hand is on my life. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. His, his hand's been on my life since the day I was born. And no matter what mistakes I make, that relationship, that love, that, that everything is going to always be there. Same thing for you. I love you guys very much. I don't know who needs to hear this message. 
I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, you guys know I love to sing. <laughs> I love to sing, and I just can't help myself. Sometimes it just, it just, sometimes it just, you, you just go there, you know. This food was delicious. Shout out to Serena, to Serena's Soul Food. Um, I enjoyed you guys today. I'll see you guys again tomorrow. I hope you guys are not tired of me. Um, make sure you guys go back and watch some of the other videos as well that I have been posting this week. And the last few days I've been posting a lot of content. So make sure you guys go back. I have another surprise for you guys. I think I'm going to tell you guys a surprise tomorrow. But I have a surprise for you. And I love you. And... For those of you who've kept me in your prayers all these years, had my back in any way, um, support me, love me, genuinely love me for me, you know, you heard something, whatever, and you're like, you know what, that's not cute. Thank you. Because a lot of it is not cute, you know, and people put labels on you and, and say things about you that is, that's not true. And sometimes you just got to let God fight your battles. Sometimes... You know, I've seen so much stuff about myself to the point where it's just like, I don't, I can't even, I'm, I don't even have the energy to defend myself on that. If you see something, listen, if you want to believe that, go right ahead. If you didn't hear it come out of my mouth, I, I, I can't tell you. You understand what I'm saying? I cannot speak on anything that I have not spoke out of my own mouth. So, whatever. But yeah, I love y'all. God is not through with me. God is not through with my career. You may think, oh, she done went downhill, whatever, child, honey. Let me tell you something. <laughs> Let me tell you something. It ain't over until the fat lady sings. And as long as I have breath in my body, God is going to continue to bless me. God is going to continue. I'm going to always be good. I'm going to always be good. And I know that. I know that to be true. So don't ever worry about me. Don't ever worry about me and what's going on with me. Um, I, I promise you I'm good. I'm healthy. I'm well taken care of. I'm, I'm good. And I want you guys to be good. And I love you guys so much. This is just a little. I didn't, I didn't mean for this to be like a heart to heart like that. But um, I love you all so much. And thank you so much for being here with me. Again, thank you for loving me genuinely. For those of you who do. Um, and I, I promise you guys, I will never focus on anybody who doesn't love me. I'm only going to give energy to those who love me and support me and genuinely appreciate what I do and the content and the singing and the animation and just everything that I bring. You deserve that. You deserve that. I love you. I, I appreciate you. And I thank you all for being here with me once again. Um, I love you no matter what you are, gay, straight, whatever, trans. I accept everybody on my channel. I love everybody on my channel. Whatever religion you are, whatever race you are, I, you're hearing it from my mouth. From my mouth. I love you and I respect you. And as long as you respect me, I'm going to respect you. That's it. That's period. That's it. I don't care what color you are, purple, green, blue. I don't care what you do at, in your bed, who you want to love. That is your business, and, and I don't look at you no different, okay? I love y'all. Now that we got that clear, let's have some fun for the rest of the month, okay? I love you guys so much. Hugs, hugs, hugs. Thank you so much for watching today's video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Mwah!